So we return to take on the much anticipated ghost house. Sorry. <clears throat> Which isn't very much anticipated at all. Because I really hate ghost houses, especially ones laced with ice. So these are just all over the place. I bet this door just Okay, no, it doesn't. What is can I move these? No. Uh did it just Yeah, it did, did just kinda of, there's a keyhole up there. I just barely saw that. So there's a pe oh my god. If you want the secret exit, you have to take a star and go in the muncher zone. Oh, and take the blue piece switch with you. Really? Well, you can take the blue piece switch like so. But how far the muncher zone? I wonder if I could huh, that actually does seem kinda of possible, to be honest. That actually does. The ice does not make it easy. However, you could make it possibly. Uh oh. I think I might have just made it. I might have just made it if this ghost would fuck off. Thank you, ghost. Come on. Don't you want to? Since you want to be in the way. God damn it, stupid ghost. Uh. I don't. Oh shit. Uh, I guess you will. What the hell? How the hell are you gonna get that? Hmm. I do wonder how you are gonna get that. That is, that is very new to me. Very new. Well, actually, hold on. You you could. You could. I kind of have an idea. All right. This is going to be trying to fake out this stupid thing. I'm going to try and jump like over. Okay. Jump like right. Damn it. Here. There. And then do this. And then wait. And then. Oh, you son of a bitch. Ghost. Oh, you can't like get over there though. It is impossible to get onto the key because it's too far over. This guy. Yeah, it's like actually. I have another idea. I have another idea. It's brilliant. This this idea can't fail. Can't fail at all. No way it's gonna fail. Come on, ghost, get over here. This idea actually has a very high probability of failure. More than like you know what? I'm just gonna do this. And then go back over here and hope I land. <clears throat> Somewhere safe. It's like way too far. Okay, good. Good. Something. All I need to do, put the P-switch down, do this, try and... I don't know if, like, sliding would help. No, sliding apparently would not help. I just want to get on the fucking key. That is all. But I can't. I would need to be big. Because it seems like you just cannot get in there. Like I said, high probability of failing, so I'm going to rewind all the way back and... Okay, good. Well, that went absolutely nowhere. I tried, though. I don't feel like solving this riddle right now. And then we come back here, which I think you could have just gone under this way. So then, where the hell do I need to go to, uh, to get a star? Also, how the hell would I get... Okay. It's all kind of coming together. But not really, because I can just do like this. Oh fuck! Actually, the P switch might be useful back here. Let me take this P switch. Might be some slidey times coming. Yeah, there's that keyhole. There's a block down there that's blocking the way, and I'd much rather be smaller here. Good. There's a pipe. What can we do with the pipe? Pipe brings me here. Uh, okay. Have you taken the shell? If not, go back and take it. You need... Thanks, jerk. Thank you so much. Well, now I can just go back and get the shell. Which is actually down here. Oh, right. How do I get the shell? How would I get this shell? I mean... I would have to be like... Yeah, I would have to I would have to do some, some fancy-ish moves here. There you go. Wow. Fuck that. Whether there's an easier way to do that or not, fuck that. But I have the shell. That's all that counts. So after four minutes of trying to get a key, that I wasn't going to get anyway. Uh, uh, oh, you son of a bitch. I hate these stupid shell bullshits. I really hope I don't need to follow that. No, I don't. Good. Good. And we got victory. Okay, that wasn't, that wasn't too terrible. That could have been worse. Could have been much worse. Could have been like that other ghost house from the other hack. Yes, I'm going to keep referencing that. If you don't know what the other ghost house is from the other hack, then you should go find the other hack. I think it was the one that was done right before this one. Donut challenge. That ghost house was a pain in the dick. Wow, oh, listen to this upbeat, happy music. 
Where's that coming from? Oh, look, it's the, yeah, it's the little donut things. These things were in Super Mario Brothers 3. The original one. Oh, the donut things. Oh, controller, you screwed me over. Thanks for flipping that turtle shell up, which I clearly didn't want to do. Why does he get two shells? He made a snowman, too. He also got two shells. What a son of a bitch. Look, it flipped it up again, but it actually worked out in my favor. It keeps doing that. Whoa, that, <laughs> that would have been unfortunate. That would have been terrible. That would have been a series of unfortunate events, even. Don't know why that snowman's there, but okay. Someone really wanted to guard that well. And there's another one of those things, so whatever. Nothing. Cool. Yoshi coin. I went to that box social last night. See, controller just keeps flipping stuff up. There, that time it actually did what I wanted it to do, but didn't even matter. Oh, shit. How about not? How did you respawn already? There you go. And, uh, it was for my, it was for one of my mom's friends. It was her 50th birthday. Which, uh, is a big number. Big number for a woman. Or any person, really. But it, it might be more, more impacted to a woman like they might they might feel a little bit worse because of that you know a woman she's uh, my old my ex-girlfriend turned like 25 and was freaking out I'm like really it seems to be a lot of my friends that end up freaking out about stupid shit like one of them turned 20 like every year he gets freaked out about something I'm like dude seriously come on now Oh, I'm 23, I'm getting old, you know, I graduated high school in 2006, blah, 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 the end of the world. Yeah, okay, yeah. 20, 23, end of the world, apparently. So remember, kids, when you turn 23, and coincidentally 22, 21, 20, 19, anything after high school, it's the end of the world. According to my friends, at least, some of them. It's just like, okay, come on. Don't be depressed about stupid shit now, we got stuff to do. Don't sit inside. Like you're 72. Oh, that was weird. But anyway, let's see. Find 23. Well, that's... That is creepy. That is actually really creepy. Find 23. So I need to find 23. But, uh... Story of my life, basically. Since... Uh, do I have to count the pillars? And jump, press up, and jump, press up. Do I really have to, like, count the pillars? Uh... Okay, so I have to... Oh, this is... This is gonna be annoying. We didn't pass 23 of these pillars, I don't think. I don't think we passed 23 of these. But just to be sure, I'll go back and count them. I'll go all the way back and count. It's like, find 23. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, there's 6, 7, 8... I don't think there were 23. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16... Son of a bitch. Okay, then what was the point? Mm. What was the point of this? I don't know what you want. Find 23. I don't know what 23 of. Looking at the background, there's like little gashes and stuff. Huh. Um, so I'm just in a big room. This is gonna just completely piss me off. I know that. This is gonna completely piss me off. I can't even finish my story. I should. I should just finish the story and be like, fuck it. Well, anyway, no matter where I go, it seems like there's a huge gap in, in age. So it's either like a bunch of older people or a bunch of kids at this point. Like young kids, like six. Like that age. So you put me in a big room, told me to find 23 and jump, press up. Okay, I, I don't. Is there like a. Is there like a door hidden behind one of these pillars? Like I, there's no invisible wall at the at the right side. That's for sure. I have a Kamek here shooting shit at me. So unless one of these has an invisible well, a door behind it, I would say. I don't understand the riddle of this Sphinx that we got going here. I figured there might be like 23 pillars. There's not. There's not 23 pillars. Huh. Okay. This might be another one of those times where I'm like, I don't know what the fuck to do, and if anyone knows what the fuck to do, please help me out. Because this invisible wall here, I've got nothing. Ugh. 
Why? Why is it just kill me? He can't even kill me when I'm just standing still. Look at that. Fast forward. Okay, let me jump in. Seriously? I died by time. Sweet. I don't get this, so I'm going to be back in one second and see if I can't figure it out. And if I can't, then this is great. Alright, and we're back, believe it or not. I found out what to do. There's an invisible coin block here. How you would how you would figure that out, I don't know, because this this all looks the same. So there's nothing on the ground that would uh that would tip you off. So what you would have to do is kind of jump around and I didn't even figure it out this way, but I'm guessing this is how he intended you to figure it out. You would have to jump around because the screen up there is is blocked out. So if I look below this, there's there's no twenty-three. But if you do jumps and stuff, you will see that there is the number twenty-three kind of right there like right above me where I'm jumping how you would find that I have no idea I'm assuming that's how he intended for you to find it just by jumping and you know looking out but like I can barely see that and I know where it's at when I'm jumping so I guess you would have to do it like even even slowly like the the top of the HUD screws it up I mean it, it kinda it overlaps it the, the top of the HUD so whatever and then when you get up here there's a door which is great and it gets you past this so we're gonna have to finish this up next time when we come back we'll get rid of or mop up the rest of this infinite corridor and hopefully there are no more riddles of the sphinx involved